Okay, Ultimate Bass, I've tested all my injectors from a Mercury 200 EFI, and I'm going to run through one test series for one injector just to show how it's done. It's a lot easier to show you than it is to explain it all out. What I have is a graduated beaker placed up under number three injector. I have an OTC electronic fuel injector tester. It has three different settings, one pulse at 500 milliseconds, 50 pulses at 10 milliseconds, and 100 pulses at five milliseconds. I have that connected to a 12 volt deep cycle battery that has 12.69 volts in it. I also am using an, a BG fuel injector, injector <clears throat> test fuel injector cleaner and I have it connected to my fuel rail with all my injectors intact just like they would be on the engine. I also have everything plugged off except for the main line going to the injectors. I'm running currently 43, 44 PSI fuel pressure and I'm using 50 to one mixture of Quicksilver oil and gas, just like you would have in your Mercury. We're gonna run through this test procedure real quick, give you an idea. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do it three times because my graduations, graduations don't start until 10 milliliters. So to get up to where I can actually read it, I need to run it 10, three times on each test. So here it goes, one pulse at 500 milliseconds. One, two, three. I have exactly 12 milliliters in the beaker. I'm going to empty the beaker into my little container here. And I'm going to go to the next test. Right underneath, directly underneath number three injector still. I'm gonna switch it over to 50 pulses at 10 milliseconds. And we're gonna inject it, pulse it three times. One, two, three. Oops, didn't do it right. Messed that one up. <laughs> Had it halfway between the first and second setting. So there you go. Always watch what you're doing. <laughs> okay, here we go. We are on 50 pulses at 10 milliseconds. One, two, three. And we have exactly 18 milliliters of fuel mixture, which I'm recording on this little notepad here that I've got for each injector at each setting. I'm going to empty the beaker again. Remember you're messing with fuel here. So... Be careful, use all precautions, don't smoke, you know, no sparks, that kind of stuff in well ventilated area. Here we go, 100 pulse at five milliseconds, three times. One, two, and three. And that gives us exactly 24 milliliters of fuel. So we're going to record that down and we're going to empty our beaker. And that is the end of the test so far. Thank you.